mtazamaji bado kuna mzozo huko nchini kuna zogo na kuna mfurugano kati ya vyama viwili ama miungano miwili hiyo ni muungano wa Kenya kwanza na muungano wa zimio la umoja je ni muungano upi kati ya hizi mbili ambayo iko na idadi kubwa ya wabunge kule bungeni ni Kenya kwanza ama ni muungano wa zimio la umoja Asante sana kwa kuweza kuichagua station ya imani kuwa kituo chako cha kukujuza na kukuelimisha. Mimi kwa Felix Arunga, ni mtafsiri wetu kwa lugha ishara. Wanyama W Murunga. Ni mwanahabari wako. Rais William Ruto aliongoza mkutano wa baraza la mawaziri katika ikulu ya Rais jana. Huu ukiwa mkutano wa pili tangu alipotoa rasmi uongozi baada ya uchaguzi wa Agosti tisa. Mkutano huu ulihudhuriwa na mawaziri wanaondoka wa serikali ya Rais Mustaafu Uhuru Mwigai Kenyatta. Aidha mkutano huo uliangazia sera na baadhi ya masuala ambayo Rais anataka yashughulikiwe kabla ya baraza lake la mawaziri kupigwa msasa na bunge na kuidhinishwa kwanza kazi rasmi. Mwanahabari wetu Masiza Lydia na kina ya taarifa hiyo ya masuala ambayo rais aliweza kuzungumzia ni masuala yanayohusiana na nyumba ya bei ya chini aliyodai wakazi wa Homa Bay alihaidi wakazi wa Homa Bay alipozuru kaunti hiyo Jumapili vile mnajua mpango hii ya housing ilikuwa ni mpango wetu pale 2017 kati ya mpango ile tulikuwa nayo ya big four one of the big four items was housing I know a lot has gone into preparing for that program and unfortunately we didn't manage to have a clear rollout of matters housing the last five years. I want to commit that in the last campaign housing was a very big part of the political discussion that we had as a country and it was a discussion on both sides of the divide ambayo yameweza kutengwa kwa minajili ya ujenzi wa nyumba hizo ambazo huku akisema kuwa hatakubali mashamba yawe tatizo kwa ujenzi wa nyumba hizo as you are aware um, this whole plan was premised on a couple of things that we needed to sort out First is to make sure that there is land that is available. Number two is to make sure that we have technology that can build houses faster and in a cost-effective manner. And number three, to make sure 